Hi there, this is Joe. Here we have CyanoNAS station, and this is the IP bird box camera from Green Bay Yard. In this video, I'm going to demonstrate how to connect this camera directly to the NAS station. So the beautiful thing for NAS station is not only can take in the hard drive for mass recording, you also have cross platform browser, so we can access the camera from different operation system including Mac, Linux, also the Windows. Alright, now let's get started. First we need to go to the next station. Here you can find the package. So we need to make sure the video station software is installed install in the in the Nash. Right now it has been installed, we click open. This is the page to configure the camera. So we click the IP camera. Here we click add. We're using the complete setup. And next step. So if your camera support on with, you can just uh, using the on with protocol. But some of the Wi-Fi robots camera doesn't support on with. So here we are going to using the user de define which almost working with all the Wi-Fi robots or IP robots camera. You just need to know the RTSP common of your IP camera. If you're using the camera with the SMEYE or ICC Pro mobile apps, this is the RTSP common. Here you need to change the IP address to your camera's IP address and the username is ADMIN. If you have add the password to the camera, this is the, cam the password of the camera. So you, you have to put the password here. Default there no password. So we copy RTSP. Now we paste here. Delete, we test. Right now the camera is streaming to the next station directory. We clean next. And almost next. Now here you can configure the recording schedule. We just leave it to the continuous. Okay, next. All right, finish. Okay, we double click the camera. Not here. Uh, we can find the live view. Live view. Alright, now we are seeing cameras live now. So the one thing very important, if your camera is using the latest compression, let's go to see. This is camera software. Right now, this is camera live using the software. The one thing important is, is if you are using the there's two com compression. If you're using the H.265, then you have problem with live on the next station because the next this moment still doesn't support H.265. So you need to make sure the compression in your camera is using H.264. Now you have switched to H.264. Then live page and the recording is normal. All right, that's all. If you have any question, you can post in comment section below. Thanks for watching.